That doesn't sound good. It appears to be unstable and very heavy. Be careful. Well, at least I've got power. And there's data here. Looks like this recluse spider thing is a testing apparatus for Gaia and Hades. I better take a look at that excess panel. Yes, get to it. Okay. I think those circular pods are repositories. One loaded with Hades backups, the other with Gaia. What are you waiting for? Hades is down, but the guy repository is stuck. So unstick it. I need to detach the cable from the arms coupling. Access that pod. I've got one. Two, in fact. I was starting to get worried. Data footprint low. Ninety percent memory free. That can't be right. I was a vast super intelligence. Really expected it. without subfunctions, but there are subfunctions out there. The original ones. Scattered to the winds when Gaia blew herself up. They could be anywhere. You can't find them in time. Even if you did, the mysterious signal mutated them just like Hades. You have no idea. I do. A good one. If it works. west of Plains on. Close enough for me to go get it. I was hoping to find all the subfunctions, but one's enough to get started, right? It is. Recover Minerva. One could use it to launch Gaia's heuristic matrix. And when she's conscious, she helps me find the other subfunctions. I go gather them. And rebuild her piece by piece. Very clever. Still think I can't save the world on my own? Intruders want the same thing you do. Gaia reborn. It's why they're here. Friends of yours? No. They don't know me. The data pulse I transmitted indicated that a Gaia backup could be recovered here was anonymous. Now, they're very powerful, but they won't harm you. Not when they see who you are, what you are. A clone of Elizabeth Sobek. A genetic key with which they can reboot Gaia and rebuild the system. They need you. I warned you, Simons. For once, Aloy, submit to the inevitable. Open the hatch. First I rebuild Gaia, save life on Earth, then I track you down and end yours! I'm trying to help you here. <clears throat> Try spying on me with that. There. New focus, spyware free. Okay. Think, 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 think. 
I don't care how powerful they are. The only thing that can open that hatch is me. The question is, can I find another way out? There's a current in the water. Not much, but maybe it's a way out. Genetic profile confirmed. Entry authorized. Greetings, Dr. Sobak. Please step inside. <laughs> Do we have it? Fantastic. Did the pulse originate here? Has someone... Something wrong? Shit! Spectres, beta! Well, any idea what the hell a clone of Elizabeth Sobek is doing here? Maybe Gaia made one, when it destroyed itself a Hail Mary to repair the system. Hmm, <laughs> don't like the sound of that. Nah, don't like it, don't want it. But the if- Nope, one's enough trouble. Eric! Yeah? Care to do a little downsizing? Hmm, sure. What if she sent the pulse? Then that was foolish of her. But we got what we came for. So let's put it to use. I snap a lot of necks in VR. But that certain tremor, as life fades from the eyes. Ooh! No hollow quite gets it. Keep flapping your mouth. It makes a nice target. You actually think that primitive crap you got there can hurt me? This is gonna be fun. Ah, it's not the same. <laughs> Oh, I'm not hurting him. I need a way out of here. <laughs> Maybe if I can... Don't breathe! I can break the cover and hold him up there. This is much as I. Oh. 
reckon that thing ain't gonna help, girl. Come on. Come at me. Bye-bye, pretty face. Was that me killing what you wanted dead? What the hell did you think? The platform collapsed, body went with it. Right. And since when don't you get what you want, huh? Spectres, search. Power room. Come and save her. Promising.
I found. Shh. It's okay. I'm here. I've... I've got it. Hey, hey, easy. Easy there. Hey, 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 hey. It's right here. And the way you were clutching it when I found you, I knew it was important. Where are we? An outpost of the Utaru tribe. Not far from where you fell. How long? Two days. Aloy? There's no time. I found something. In the mountains it's west of Plain Song. Yeah. Kept muttering it while I carried you. Look, Aloy, whatever it is that you found, you're in no shape. To... I will crawl if I have to. Okay, fine. But before you do that, there's someone you should talk to. An Utaru named Zo. And she told me there's been trouble in those mountains. A cave spitting out deadly machines. Can't be a coincidence, right? Why do we need her? Let's head for the cave. It's in Utaru territory. Her territory. She can help us. You'll see. Fine. Let's go see this marvelous so then. As verdant limbs wither, roots rot in snow, still the seed rises as certain as stone. So? She should be in bed. Aloy doesn't really do should. You're so right. Verl said I should talk to you. About the machines. In the mountains west of Plainsong. I am a grave singer. My place is here. We can talk once you've healed. What's wrong with it? Her. The name is Ray, not it. She's one of our land gods. And she's dying. But not just dying. She's suffering. Her condition is not your concern. So, if anyone can help, it's Aloy. May I? to do might look bad, but it will help. Spear. West of Plain Song. There's trouble out there. The Utaru have trouble everywhere. Our fields blighted, our settlements abandoned. But the cave in the mountains is the worst of it. It is a sacred place. Fa, another of our land gods, went inside weeks ago, but she hasn't emerged. Killer machines pour out instead, threatening to overwhelm us. It's never happened before. 
Wouldn't be your first sacred cave. You called yourself a grave singer. What does that mean? To all living things, an end must come. It is my task to ease the passage. I try to bring comfort and sing of the renewal that death sows the way for. But I never thought I would have to sing for one of our land gods. I don't even know if Ray hurt me. What you did soothed her more than I ever could. It's not your fault, Saul. And without the second sight, there's nothing more you could have done. So the cave is sacred because machines like Ray and the one you call Fa go inside? Yes. Before the derangement, each land god left the fields and made a pilgrimage to the cave. Always in the same order. Doe first, then Ray, then me, and so on. Spattered with soil from their labors, each reappeared two days later, shining anew, without so much as a scratch. All soil and ornaments of worship washed away. The tribe celebrated each return as one of the eight hallowed festivals of our calendar. But the derangement changed the cycle. Yes, or so we thought. Over time, the land gods stopped the ritual, becoming crazed and brittle. But three weeks ago, Fa trudged inside. The entire tribe lifted their voices in song, praying that the cycle had begun again. Fa has not emerged. What has our machines built to kill? Are machines being made inside? Like in a cauldron? Sounds like it. But the way these land gods come and go, it's not like anything I've seen before. Ray and other machines like her, you call them gods? Land gods, yes. For generations, they provided for us, seeding and harvesting the fields of plain song. Food for all, <laughs> a miracle of endless bounty. A farm run by machines. More than a farm, a blessed land providing sustenance for my people, until the derangement. I need to get into that cave. What? No one does that. Well, it's time to make an exception. It belongs to the land gods. Look, so. There is something inside there. Something that could solve problems all over the world. The storms, the derangement. <laughs> Maybe even your broken land gods. What could possibly do all that? A spirit? Yeah. Something like that. I could journey back to Plainsong, assemble the chorus, tell how you soothed Ray, ask their permission to go inside. Great. I'll get my things. <laughs> <laughs> She needs rest. You don't have to tell me. Okay, I'm fine. Assembling the chorus will take time. Heal first, then join me. Fine. Bed rest. I got it. She does not need you to help her heal. You could come with me to plain song. Lend your voice to mine as I try to persuade the chorus. It might help her cause. I'd like to, but I'm afraid she might run off. Really? Very well. Later then. So, wait. It's not a. Uh that I don't want to go with you. It's just that I... Shh. <laughs> Is that what you were trying to say? Um... Yes. 
Then I look forward to more conversation. Uh, yeah, me too. <laughs> You're supposed to be resting. Laurel, you should go with her. I'll get better on my own. You trying to get rid of me so you can... <sighs> no. Not this time. I'll meet up with you in plain song when I'm ready. You sure about this? Yes. Go. <laughs> Get out of here. Okay. So, wait. Who are they? To meet Laurel and Zoe in plain song. Ask the chorus if we can go into their sacred cave. The blight is worse here. If I don't get Gaia up and running, it'll be like this everywhere. the Utaru's land gods. So in the fields with blight. It's like they're still following their programming. Even though it's killing everything. to, uh, go around. There's Laurel and Zoe. I'm here, as promised. That's singing. Does it mean the chorus is ready? It is assembled. I couldn't have done it without Varl. But I don't know what good it will do. The chorus is in disharmony. The subject of the cave is bad enough. Land God Fa still hasn't emerged, and every day more deadly machines try to force their way out, throwing themselves against the defensive cordon we set up around the entrance. That is only the first of many false notes. Your request has exposed deep divisions within the chorus itself and the tribe. So, the chorus is assembled. What now? They're considering your request. Then shouldn't we go talk to them? When you're ready. But don't worry. Their debate won't end anytime soon. Meetings like these can go on for days. <sighs> All right. Then maybe I should resupply first. Who knows how many machines are in that cave? Assuming the chorus agree to allow you inside. Aloy can be pretty convincing in these situations. We'll see. Do what you need to prepare. We'll wait for you above, where the chorus has gathered. So the scene just keeps going. I guess that means the chorus is still in session? The people sing to soothe the chorus, to help them break their impasse. It wouldn't be necessary if they were in harmony. I'm not gonna have to sing back, am I? Of course not. The singing will stop when we present ourselves. Are you ready? All right, let's go talk to them.
Speak. Your sacred cave. There's something inside I need. And if I can get it, it so will help. and the Nora have spread word of your story. And what you want. We know of no spirit in the cave. Only Fa, our land god, who entered the cave and did not return. The power of the land gods is broken. We are diminished. Tales of spirits will not help us. Nothing will. We weaken. We die. And become fertile ground for new life. This is the natural order. Yes. Wait. You're all just going to sit around? Until you become food for worms? Literally? So says the Outlander, ignorant of our beliefs. What does she know? Please, remember how she brought peace to Ray. Listen to her. We've heard such temerity from you before, Zo. Let us not forget that you agitated for reckless war against the Kaja. At least she's trying to help. Ah, by inviting you to break our traditions, change our ways to suit every impudent outsider who wanders into plain song? No. You should change your ways because your own lands are killing you. She has a point. We have stood by and watched as our land gods waste away. You would have us do the same with our neighbors, our children. And this lone outlander can save us. <laughs> Nonsense. A single seed matters little in the infinite cycle of growth and decay. An alarm. It's coming from the mountains. What's happening? Was that from the cordon? It's an alarm! The machines must have broken through the cordon. Then we need to get down there. What about the chorus? If the cordon has fallen, there's nothing left to prevent us from going in the cave. The time for permission is over. Then off we go. This way, out the gate and around. Fighting in the fields ahead. These machines don't look normal. I've seen these machines before. Hunter killers. They must have come from the cordon. The others will defend Plainsong. We have to move. Do you really think we can do something about all of this? No. Yeah. More machines! These machines are stronger, deadlier than normal. There's more than just Minerva and a missing land god in that cave. This trail is the path of the land gods. It'll lead us to the cordon. More machines! We can take them out, Aloy. On your lead. Should use shock arrow. Take the machines down! 
spotted. Something ruined, Aloy! That's the last one. Now onto the cordon. That was. Let's go. Right behind you. We're almost there. So many machines broke through. What happened to the cordon's defenders? We better be ready for anything. going into the cave make what is that a kind of wall made of light we'll have to find a way around we'll follow your lead uh, Aloy up here That ahead, like a cauldron door. To understand what's going on in there, you're gonna need one of these. On the temple, just like this. There's blue light on the door. Yeah, it takes some getting used to. Don't worry, Zoe. I'll help. Now listen. The machines we've been fighting, they're different. More dangerous. That means there's something very powerful somewhere beyond that door. And it wants us dead. 
follow my lead and be ready for anything. We have to find the core of this place. There's so much metal. Who built this place? Machines. Not like any you've seen before. Machines in here. We'll have to take them out. Right behind you, Abel. done so this is a cauldron where machines are born it looks like one but if the land gods come and go then they aren't just made here they're being repaired too and the spirit you're after is in here Minerva maybe but I have a feeling that's not all Those cables are glowing. I've seen them before. They're like an infection. That thing I said, that wants us dead. It takes over places like these and makes killer machines. It's called a festus. Even the mountain is rotted to the Looks like those cables are blocking the way up. You two wait here. I'll find another path. Okay. Huh. Standing on this floor panel, activated something. Looks like parts of those pillars are rotating. Maybe if I shoot the gears, I can lock them into place. Make a path up. Oh, it didn't work. If the gears have to be in the right spot. There. Should be able to climb all the way up now. And there she goes. beyond the wall. It's massive, whatever it is. Craig, looks heavy. <sighs> Can't fit the crate through that opening. That's it. The gears on the pillars should be exposed now. Looks like there are only two pillars this time. How are you doing, Zoe? This place it was meant for the land. There. Should be able to get across now. Has ever set foot in here. But I had to, right? To help you and Aloy. <clears throat> to find Fa. You did the right thing, Zoe. How's it going up there, Aloy? I think I'm getting close. One more set of pillars. There should be a floor panel nearby to activate them. One down, two to go. Good aim. 
Okay, now I can cross. Festus's cables are all over that node, but maybe I can override it. Got it. The cables are moving. They're drawing back. We can climb up that vent. How do we cross? Cables are twisted around that node on the other side. I'll see if I can get to it. Get up to the node. This will be in my stash when I need it. Come on over, you two. Who is that? Hephaestus. It's taken over this whole place. Activate. Gamma Matrix 5. Looks like there's another node on the other side. Near that door. Go do your thing. How to get to that node on the other side? Okay, there's a platform down there. I think I can reach it if I go out. A rush of air. Hephaestus. What does it want with this place? Stash this away. It's taken over facilities before to build deadly machines. But it wasn't always hostile. It used to be part of something good. More of those cables covering that door. I think we're almost at the core. Be ready. Gotcha. What has Hephaestus done to her? Turn it into a weapon, which sooner or later will be unleashed. And then, plain song. If my people see what it has become, if one of our gods attacks them, you know what we have to do. Laurel. 
Are you ready? We have to get down there. That dome of light. Is it protecting the machine? Yeah. There should be a node I can override nearby to shut it down. Here we go. I'm sorry. Yes! More machines are coming! And I'll get the big guy! Weapons on its back. If I can detach them, I can use them against it. machine that nearly killed us it's still her god i do not grieve for a god or a machine but because i no longer know what to believe look so if you want you can go back home do i still have one and if so for how long can you really heal our lands save my people One step at a time. But it starts now. Up we go. There's more. Like Aloy said, this is only the beginning. Aloy, the core. My focus is showing holograms on it. They look like machines. Overrides. Knowledge on how to tame machines. And you can learn this? Yes. Got what you need? Yes. Let's press on then. Graduates of Cradle 9, welcome to the regional... Error. Unauthorized access detected. Uh, that doesn't sound good. Was that the spirit? Minerva? I, I don't think so. At least... Attention. All personnel must vacate the facility. Immediately. Something? What exactly was this place? Seen anything like it before? No. Error. Unauthorized access. Initiating facility lockdown. Stay out. What's going on? Well, at least the emergency lights work. 
What just happened? Minerva's definitely here. And I think it's trying to keep us out. I'll scout ahead, see if there's a way to get us in. You sure we shouldn't come with you? Well, yeah, Minerva could be dangerous. Let me make sure it's safe. Okay. We'll be right here if you need us. Are you doing okay, Zo? Zo? All this. Minerva. Hephaestus. Gaia. This is what will help heal plain song? Okay. It's hard to explain. I, I need mean, to find where Minerva's hiding. I barely hiding. understand it, but... I should look yeah, for a way to access the facility systems. what I've been looking for this whole time. Locked. Here. Nope, sorry. You're not getting rid of me that easily, Minerva. What are all those cables in the center for? Huh. Might be able to pull that open. Let's see where this leads. I can feel a draft above. Might be a way out of this shaft. Well, looks like another part of the facility. Don't think I'm getting through that door right now. I should turn back, see what else I can find. Outside. I need to find a way back into the facility. Maybe I could look for a way in higher up the mountain. Oh, I'm close. If I can get Minerva to cooperate, I can merge it with Gaia. Finally bring her back. Then we can start fixing the blight, the storms, and maybe she's in the proving lab war. Why did they have a clone of Elizabeth? Why do they want it back up? Huh? Uh. I might be able to glide to that ledge. Those rocks look loose. I think I can clear them. Aha, another shaft. Okay, now I've got to find a way to plug into this place. Looks like some kind of dome. Wonder what it's for. Alert! System core penetrated. No! Minerva, I need the console. Please. Access denied. It didn't used to be like this. Do you remember it? Anything? You were part of something bigger once. Something good. 
Gaia. That's right. She can live again. But only if you give her the chance. I can't reboot her without you. Will I cease? I think you'll disappear into her. Become part of her. Like you used to be. Azuri will cease. Yes. Thank you. Thank you, Minerva. Elizabeth Sobek. Alpha Prime. Master Override activated. Restoring Minerva function to original code. Do you wish to initiate heuristic matrix? Here goes. So it is Aloy, not Elizabeth. We have much to discuss, but initialization of my heuristic matrix will not be complete for several minutes more. In the meantime, I suggest you familiarize yourself with this facility. It is our best option for a base of operations, and you can make use of its equipment to improve your ability to override machines. Um, uh, uh, yeah. Yeah, that, that sounds good. Shall I grant access to your companions? They will be here shortly. Um... Okay, but... Don't overwhelm them, okay? They don't have a lot of experience with things like... Well... You. Uh, so no fake this time? No. This time she's real. Varl, so This is Gaia. Hello. Hi. Hi. Gaia's still, uh, waking up. Let's look around. I will highlight the location of the lab on your focus. 